guys, what is up? Welcome back to another episode of the channel. Today we are playing more of Alan Wake 2. Now we left off and we have, we're in the wellness centre, right? And we are looking for Tor. Tor has been, what, what we think is being consumed by the Dark Presence. So we are looking for him. There's some freaky ass la old lady around here, right? We know that, um, we know the leaders of the group are Ilmo and, um, is it Yako or, or Yesko or something like that? So we're in a situation right now where uh, it's gotten a bit creepy. It's gotten very creepy. We've got to go back through rehabilitation and we're going to go back to... Well, oh, that's strange. Hmm. We're going to go back down this creepy-ass corridor, which was... Where was that corridor? Here? Yeah, this creepy-ass corridor here, which I hated. And we're going to go... Was that open before? Oh, it's missing the doorknob, isn't it? Right. Stop it. C uh, leave that open, actually. Leave that open. So, this time, what we're going to do, guys, is we're going to... Go to our case file. Um, here. And we're going to go... To... The case board and we're gonna go to the story can't do them yet so let's go back to cases let's do the cult of the tree and there's more so cult initiation letter addressed to vladimir blum um that should be in who's part of the cult right maybe who's involved there we go so someone else that's involved vladimir blum who is that He's a confirmed cult member. The letter looks new. Seems like he was recruited recently. Cult initiation lessons are signed by Ilmo and Yako hmm. Koskela. That's interesting. So they were running the cult, but they said to us it's not what it looks like. You have to remember that. Now, I don't think they would say that for no reason whatsoever, to be brutally honest with you. So I... I feel there's more here than meets the eye. Um, also, I know we just we just sort of dove straight into this one, didn't we? Look, make, uh, make sure you get your, your drinks and snacks as well, guys. And uh, yeah, welcome back as always. I don't think I said any of that. Odin what? said Thor needs help. But from what? Oh, I've just forgotten. Is he turning into a Taken? Yeah, that's what it looks like, right? Where is Thor? What is Thor becoming? So... Um, Tor's assigned bed is empty. Would be, wouldn't it? Nope. Where is Tor? There. So if Tor was brought here to rest, he didn't stay long. Tor left through the cafeteria door. Mm -hmm. Tor mm -hmm. left the wellness center. Tor is inside the wellness center. No, Tor left the wellness center. Door is locked electronically. Cafeteria door. Maybe it's controlled remotely. Need to find the controls. Parser protected security <laughs> computer. The computer yeah. controlled the door that Tor went through. Um, so yeah, what does this say? The computer must unlock the door. If I can figure out the password, I can get in. And then it says computer password. So we've got data. No, dates are common passwords. Might be something here. Letter stating indication is the day after the moon. Uh, this is going to be a bit strange. Blum recently joined the cult. Is anyone here not a damn cultist? Chart says Tor's behaviour has been increasingly hmm. volatile. Oh, come on. Really? Oh, uh, Tor becoming taken. Tor's been acting strain, uh, strangely violently. Yeah, well, that's just standard, isn't it? Bloody bandage found on Tor's bed. Blood is still fresh. That should be... Uh, where is Tor, really? Hmm. I would have put that, but we'll put it there, I guess. Why remove a bandage when you're still bleeding? Yeah, I, I, oh, bro, I hope you haven't lost him, but I'm guessing we have. Let's just put the mask I on I need there. to get the clicker to wake and close this damn case before my family gets dragged any further into it. I mean, we know that, but there we go. Case is closed. I need to get the clicker to wake, but I still have questions. Those old guys, Tor and Odin, seemed friendly with the cult. How are they connected to all this? Uh, the story. Why is it still giving us the story? Yeah, but it won't let me do these yet. Right. So, 
it's something to do with the date. So let's go back here. Let's just look at this. It could, uh, oh, 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 oh. I already get it. Okay. Where was this? Here? Was it here? No, was it here? No. Where was that, that thingy about the computer? Accepted. Vladimir Blum. The country welcomes you. There was a thingy here about what the dates are, right? Wasn't there? Look, May 5th is full moon. What was that thing that we had that had all the dates of the actual... Where was that thing that we had? We had a thing, right, that had all of the dates on it. Or oh, not all the dates, all of the... Um, it, it said, like, the... the um, oh, my gosh. My brain's gone blank. It said, like, full moon... Back moon, it said that all of that. Where was that? Was that in the cult of the tree? Was that here somewhere? Which one was that in? Fat versus fiction? No. Previous, mo no. The story? The cult stashes, nursery rhymes, lunchbox, the trail of the cult. Uh, fat versus fiction. It wouldn't be there. It would be like the previous murders. The story. Which one haven't I looked at? Yeah, they said they stashed it. No, that's not it. Where's the one that we had? It's none of these. It's not going to be Alex Casey's lunchboxes, is it? It should be the Trail of the Cult, right? Where is the mask? No, that one we've just done. The Anderson Brothers, of course. Right, so it said here, computer password, dates are common, passwords might be something there. But I swear there was an actual thing in this room. Am I just missing it? Am I being silly? 15th of the 8th, 16th of the 8th. Also, it's saying what? It's saying that there's something I haven't picked up here. Why is it saying that? Is there something here that I'm missing? Do you see that, guys? It's saying there's like an empty card here. Like, oh. Day and month. He uses European formatting. Day then month. I'll be honest, guys. It should always be day then month if you want my honest opinion. I hate it when it's month and day. I have what I need to figure out the password. It just makes sense, like the 16th of May, you know, 16.04.23, not 04.16. Like, that, to me, that's just strange. It makes no sense, but I guess, you know, if any of you are from America, you probably think the complete opposite. He sounds excited, wonder what he's planning. Yeah, so, it's to do with these days. So 14, six, uh, 14, oh eight, 15, the 8th, and 16th, the 8th. 14, 15, 16. 14, 15, 16. So 14th, 14th, 16th, 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 14th would be. Uh, 14th, 15th, 16th, okay, 14th, 15th, 16th, what, I should put that into the computer? 14th, 15th, 16th, huh. He was excited about the 14th, 15th, and 16th of August. August. 14th. Ah ha ha. Okay. 14th is a Monday, but there's nothing actually happening, though. It's not telling us. The 16th was a new moon. Why was he excited about the new moon? This is interesting. 14th, 15th, 16th. 
What is that? New moon, yeah. 16th is a new moon, but this doesn't tell us... What's happening these days, then? I'm not going to lie, I'm a little bit confused, guys. But what am I looking at here? Come on, bro, what am I looking at here? Come on, give me some kind of idea. Give me some kind of idea here. Yeah, this has stumped me. It could be anything. Guys, I'm actually gonna have to look this one up. Oh, you all you right, okay. So what you have to do is you have to look for the new moon. So on the 16th the new moon hits, so the 17th, which is the day that he circled, it would be so you basically put the 17th. I was I thought it was digits of different calendar dates, but no, it's the 17th, and then what month is it? August, so 08, 23. So 170823, okay. 170823. Eight. 23 okay okay it's not yeah i way over and the doors it. are open is there anything else here i'm a little i'm a little doorknob that's out of place but solve these clues and you can trace the way to your private space i meet you at the greet inside a bright glassy cage where the prettiest flowers bloom why did you stick the door why did you take the doorknob to my personal room i am sick of old people tricks you bring it back so i can get my rifle i'm supposed to go on a deer hunt tomorrow if you don't, I will hunt you instead. Vladimir, I do not need to remind you that Tor and Odin would be ideal candidates for the cult, but at least try harder to recruit them. Oh. There's Tor. And he's out of his mind. Did you see that need shadow? Need to get to him. Let's watch this all the way through. Off he goes. Bro, what if we can't save him? What if we can't save him? I don't know. That would be nuts. Do you know, I didn't bring a drink. I didn't bring anything, bro. I could stop to get one, but now I'm into the thick of it. You know how it is. Once we started, that's it. There's no going back. Let's get out of this. Um, now I'm expecting... Get in here. Oh, we're back. What's this? A page? How did I miss this? Two apples and a banana there. Have a quick snack. Tor Anderson had lightning in his veins. This was rock and roll, baby. That weaver girl had cast a spell on him. Tor would do anything she'd ask. Tor deserved this. Tor wanted this. Mm. She wanted the song. A gift. He had to get it for her. Afterwards, it was too late. Tor swung his hammer in frustration. The spark was gone. Black liquid clogged his mind. Ugh. A bad trip. Tor fought it. He was strong. He'd never be taken. But the darkness could still drown him. Tor needed to warn someone. It was all happening again. Tom was back. Coming back. Tom would need help too if he was going to make it. Who's Tom? But the brothers were too old to stop oh, at this time. Why? Tor had called someone. Someone who could help. The name escaped him. Drowned beneath dark water. Saga? Saga, right? Bro, you know when you're getting getting all this ammo. Like the thing is in, in this game, bro, it goes so quick. It's still just telling us to find Tor. I'm gonna head back to where we were. Here, and then make a move. Tor? Just as far as Tor, but I don't know where the... What is he, in here? Are you in here, bro? Oh, bro, I'm so sorry, guys. I forgot to turn off. Do you know, I've been so good with notifications. I've been so good with notifications, but I'm so immersed. I, I, you have to forget at some point. Right, let's just get back. Well, he's not down there. We've just been from there. We've just been from there. I have no intention of going down. Oh! Shit! Who the f is that? Who the fuck is this? Oh, 
What? Have you seen the effects though? The visual effects? Like the water effect? How are you still alive? Oh my gosh, that is incredible. No. You took every one of my helps. You're incredible. Kick his ass. Jesus Christ. Just beat him with a melee. Just beat him with a melee, bro. So who were you, sir? Who were you? Were you from the home? Talk to me, bro. Get in here. Need to catch up with Tor. No, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I have turned down the volume a little bit because my mum's in. I don't wanna I don't wanna be too loud and, and um she thinks someone has literally been murdered in my room so I've turned down the volume a little bit so I don't jump as loud okay um, mittens and homemade a notebook full of daily meal plans a nice fountain pen an antique hair clip very pretty and address and inquiries to your friend Rose I found an ammo box of ammo for a hunting rifle in the cafeteria Rose I think you left some behind again you should really be more careful take a tip from Vlad a fellow weapon enthusiast always lock it up come collect it from me whenever you can Brought that tea you said you liked. I can make a cup if you want. I need the rifle. If there's a rifle that I can get, trust me, I need it. Okay. Now this is. This must have been Tor's. Oh yeah. So Tor hasn't been this way. So can we I don't know though. That looks. That looks. That we can call it. Let's just come. Let's just go through here. Oh, uh, okay, yeah, I'm still going to jump anyways, bro. Why did I even bother? I haven't turned it down that much, so... But I don't want to turn it down too much, bro. It's a horror game at the end of the day. We were made to jump. We were made to jump. But I don't get who that old man is. Like, who the fuck is that, bro? You know what I mean? Who the... Oh, what is that? Floor. Still gets me, though. Oh, someone behind. Open this up right now. Where are we outside? Tor, don't go. What? Tor Anderson, you come out of here this minute. That water is bad. Oh, this is so cool. Saga, get in there. Saga, get in there. See, those ones don't scare me because it's the same. Weaver, I know it's you. This kind of a she knows. She knows. We turned up the volume, bro. Fully now. Oh my gosh. Damn. It's fight time. Tor? Find a way into the There's overlap. an overlap here. Did Cynthia pull Tor in? Speak to her. What was that? Where did Tor go? She knows. What on earth do you mean, Saka? Tor is resting in the wellness center. Remember? She really gonna say what? that after what we just saw. We both saw him go into the pond. <laughs> okay. What? Are you fucking with me? Or, or is this a story again? Now, now. Let's cool it with the language. She's clearly lying to me. Yep, yeah, let's profile her. Why? Let's profile her and find out. Finally, we're profiling this creepy ass bitch, bro. Rose watched Honestly. Tor go into the pond. Why is she lying to me? The secret mission for Alan's number one fan. What? The hero will say Wake has returned. We're all characters in his story. Gee whiz. I'm not his fucking character. But I can use that phrase to make Rose stop lying to me. Mm. Wake has returned. Cynthia Weaver. Cynthia took tour. What happened to her? When the darkness touches your head, 
Your bookshelf gets shuffled. I put her lamp in the shoe box. What do you call a lamp lady without her lamp? Is Rose talking about Cynthia or herself? Or both? <laughs> Look at all these profiles we've got as well, man. There's so many. Okay. Well, I think... Wake has returned. Rose. Um, Wake has returned. <gasps> oh my god. You're the hero. You're here to save Alan. Oh, I feel so silly for trying to keep you out of the wellness center. I locked Torrendale in there after they lost it, and I didn't want you getting hurt. <laughs> Before I forget, Here's the page Wake told me to give you. Cool. Oh, and you'll need my keys to get around. Thank you. Rose's key. Saga book. jabbed the selector on the jukebox. The missing record in its place. Saga couldn't have found it without Odin's help. A light bloomed in through the garden window. The horror story beat me to Tor. Just... I have to rescue him. Let's just listen to the this. key to this overlap is an old gods of Asgard record. Odin will know more. Saga jabbed the selector on the jukebox. The missing record in its place. Saga couldn't have found it without Odin's help. Standing there, Saga felt exposed. Expecting the shadows to come alive. This is so cool. The though. needle crackled on the vinyl. I the love song this. swelled. Odin had said it was written for her and her mother. Her grandfather's apology. The lamentation of an old man. His heart was broken, sinking into darkness. Odin had said that the song would be a way to know Tor, a way to find him. A light bloomed in through the garden window. That's where Tor had vanished into the pond. Saga knew what she had to do. Okay, and we can profile more of Odin as well, so let's do that. Page mentions a missing record. A missing record. Do you know where it is, Odin? Driven by passion, raging like a storm. Your grandfather made the song to apologize to your mother, Freya, and to you. Tours like a storm. Your mother did the right thing, leaving with you. Even if it broke your grandfather's heart and mine. Listen to the song, Saga. It's all there. Tor only had one record made. He keeps it in the museum. Odin knows my mom's name. He's saying my mom took me away when I was still a baby. Plausible. Stay on task. The record is in the museum. Where is the museum, though? That's what I want to know. So not taking dance presents, manipulating him, destroying him. I would say it's just destroying him. Into the pond. Tor disappeared into the pond. It's another overlap. Mm -hmm. Has to be. How do I get inside? That is the question, isn't it? Um, Cynthia and Tor overlap the ritual. And now we got these, Saga Jabbed. So I think Saga Jabbed the record has got to be an overlap ritual. Yeah, I need to play a record to open the overlap. Another ritual, I should talk to Odin. Uh, Wake told Rose to look for the hero. She won't help anyone else. <coughs> Cynthia and Tor? No, that's, that's overlap ritual, okay. Yeah, because without her, we wouldn't have been able to even start it, right? The page says the record will open the overlap. Or is the page predetermining it? Am I just playing into the story? I don't think so. There was only one copy of the record. Tor kept it in the nursing home museum. Okay. They kept it in the museum. Must have been important to them. What I want to do is go back to the wellness center because they mentioned a rifle. And I want the rifle. I mean, that looks like this all opens up to me. What's this here? Another page? 
Let's read this. No? Okay. Don't want to read it then? Okay, bro. Whatever you say, bro. Yeah, let's get back in here. Because... Now I have the key fob. Now I have the key fob. I should be able to... Where was that case? Wasn't it around here? Lost and found? Did we even take this? I don't even know. She says she locked it up. Where did I find it? I can't remember. Let's just explore this section again. Make sure we can't... Oh, we can't go through here. We can't go through here. Okay, I thought maybe we could, but we can't. Right, we had a fight with someone in here. We've done all that. I want to get to the main home section because oh, well quickly, yeah, quick save, lovely. If we can get that rifle, if there is actually a rifle, it might be lies. Oh, there's so much here, bro. Look at this. This is why you've got a search. Look, Gail taken. Gail Barrows stared at his chest X-ray. It was in his left lung. It felt like a black hole. An opening to darkness. He felt like he was drowning. He coughed and coughed and coughed. So hard his whole body and soul felt twisted and mangled. Ugh. Upside down and inside out. With every cough the black hole grew bigger. It felt good. It tore him up but it felt good. Gail was dying. The black hole was sucking everything good out of him. He imagined looking through it. Into the darkness. The black hole grinned. Gale couldn't escape its gravity. He worshipped it. Gale sacrificed to it. In blood. <sighs> Lovely. Odin loses an eye? Did we do this? It's 1988. A face-off between deities on the rim of Cauldron Lake, high above its dark waters. Thunder roared. The old gods facing something even more powerful. Something harder to define, even. Or, changing the perspective, raving lunatics all, caught up in the frenzy of a shared delusion. The old gods, the corsairs of the Sea of Night, and the Dark One who yearned to stand in between, who had always stood in between, who would soon stand in between. We help you, you stay away from our family, Tor Anderson snarled over the thunder. Yes, until you all come to me, came the answer. That's never going to happen, shouted Odin. I will take this as collateral. Shall you remember our deal, said the Dark One. Blood arched from Odin's face as he fell to his knees. Lightning hit the dark figure on the cliff. And with that, he was gone. Tor rushed to his brother. Are you all right, bro? Effectively blind in that moment, the eye patch covering his left eye, his hand over the now empty socket of his right, blood oozing out of it. Odin cursed. The bastard took the wrong eye. Right. Okay, and if I just quickly go here, I don't know how many guns you can get. I'd like to think like three, one on either side. Uh, we'll see, I guess. We'll find out soon enough. And what's this say? Gale Burrows, violently outbursts resulting from rapid onset dementia should be restrained whenever possible until the dosage can be found that impedes his aggression. Something here. This is why we go back through. This is exactly why we go back through. Um, I don't think there's anything else here. I want to open up. How do I get to this section? This is what I want to open up. I want to open up that section. There's obviously a way. Have you been here? Oh, of course we have. I need that doorknob, don't I? Yeah, I wonder where that doorknob is. Not that there seems to be... There's a rifle in there. Where do I get the doorknob? Is there any, like... Stop it. Why is it, why is it kicking off here? What did I do? I 
don't actually think there's anything here, guys. No, I thought maybe we'd find the, the doorknob. I really need a secondary gun, bro. Like, we are struggling right now. Weapon-wise, man, I'm struggling with just a pistol, I can't lie. Like, the fact that we haven't found the, the shotgun either is what's getting to me. I could really do, just that secondary gun would be amazing. Fighting against, like, the more difficult people. Oh. The lights just turned on. Right, well, we've got to go into this house, right? So let's just get lights ready. Uh, I guess first things first. Anything here? Can't open this with my bare hands. And the key fob won't do anything. So we've got to check the nursing homes museum. So it's obviously going to kick off in here. So let's just. Look how dark it is. How quiet this is. Oh, hang on. Let's just check the... Can we go for the front way? We can go for the front way now. That's so weird going through the front. Ugh. Is there a doorknob in here? I don't think I actually have ever checked this area. This is interesting now. We were never able to check this. Wow. More ammo. Um, I actually think whilst we're here, we should probably take some paint. <gasps> We've got the door on. Right. Confidence. Confidence is growing a little bit, a tiny bit, now that we've got that key, things are picking up a tad, that is massive progress, see that's my problem right, let me tell you what my problem is, I felt that it should have been that easy to get the um, shotgun. I felt like we've we've gone far too far with that. I felt like that's how easy it should have been to get the shotgun. Close this. Stroke the deer. Poor thing. There's going to be like some s sort of correlation to the deers, right? I think that it's all to do with the cult of the mask stuff, but oh baby. Oh no, I'm I'm savoring this moment with the with that rifle. Let's read this. Ilmo was nervous. His palms were clammy. Ugh. He lowered his phone. Mulligan isn't picking up. Yako shook his head, pointed at his own phone. Same with Thornton. Ilmo didn't like it. No one was answering the phone at the workshop in Watery either. Something was up. It had to be the writer. Had to be. The Coscula brothers were crouching in the bushes across from the Elderwood Palace Lodge, its light shining in the night. They couldn't wait any longer. The brothers knew Saga was in Watery visiting her trailer. Going now was their only chance to do this without hurting her. Ilmo stood up in a crowd of deer masks looked his way. Okay, this is it. The rider is the target. Take him down and it's all over. Only shoot the Fed if you have to. This is our big moment. We watch in the night. The crowd murmured the chant back to him. Ilmo turned his face to the hotel. He could see Saga's partner in the window. Ilmo slapped his brother on the shoulder. The brothers donned their masks. The cult of the tree was ready. So what I'm gathering from this is that... Hang on, let's just grab this. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, thank you. You have no idea how much it means to me to see that. You have no idea. Quick slot this bad boy to that should really go there and then this should be quick slotted to there right I feel 
much better now that we've got that. I'm brutally honest with you. Let's get out of here. And let's go up. Towards... Well, let's go back into the house. And make our way through. Could you imagine... I was thinking this. It literally just occurred to me. The thought just occurred. Could you imagine... Right. If you are like someone like Ilmo or Yako, essentially you have no choice about if you're written into the story or not. And if you're written into the story, what are you dead? Like, what if like, the FBI agent shoots you? Right. Are you just automatically. What's this sound? Odin's stuck in bed. Odin Anderson stirred in his bed, his vision hazy, smudged. He felt weighted down by an ocean of dark water. Through the haze, he made out Saga. Odin felt useless. He wished he could tell Saga how his silly faces made her smile when she was young. Too young to remember. Odin used to joke that Tor was her grandfather, but he was the all-father. He smiled at the memory. Odin was the kinder of the Anderson brothers. Tor lacked patience, more volatile. The brothers fought a lot, but they were inseparable. Now Tor was missing, dragged into darkness. Odin could feel it. Time was running out for both of them. Yeah, are you like... If you die in this nightmare, because you're just written into the book as a character, but if you die in this story, are you dead forever? Is that like... Is that permanent? Help. Rescue tour from the overlap. Check the nursing homes. Museum. Where is it on the map? I'm getting nervous, bro. It's my bad. The museum is where? Conversation, new choices on top floor. So we'll go to top floor. But the museum is where? New choices here as well. Where's the museum? I'm in the right spot, right? Okay, well, now we're in this freaky ass place. We'll go through. Look, the fact that they're all empty, yeah, they're all part of the cult. They're all part of the cult, bro. 100%. You, you can just tell. You can just tell. Okay. That scared me, I'm not going to lie. Quick save here. Um, I love my quick save. Have we got... Have we got... A oh, Museum Hall of Fame. Oh, yeah, shit. Here we go. Is that it? Oh, I knew that was gonna happen. I knew that was gonna happen. This is the one. But it's gone. Cynthia has the record. Of course she, she does. Tell me where to find it. Uh, no, no. We, this is oh, this is the bitch. I cannot wait to kill this bitch. <laughs> What's that laugh? I can't wait to find this bitch. I cannot wait to to. Yep, she's done for. She's done for. She's been terrifying me for too long why did mum leave so from the few things mum said this is actually plausible is it really true what did Tor do to make mum leave hmm. let's go over and profile Cynthia crazy Cynthia Cynthia targeted Tor specifically why why him deal with a nasty Anderson fellow his heart was broken, cancelled. Leaks started appearing. It was too late. The rifle. Shut her out the... of her own case. The dark presence is using Cynthia to keep me from talking to Tor. Fair play. Uh, you kind of feel sorry for her, but at the same time, she is scary. Where is Angus' remorse now? He is a young girl in love. 
Where is she? Anger's remorse. Where is it, Cynthia? Drowned beneath dark water. In the overlap? Too many heads. No. The bathroom frightened her. Cut short. She screamed. And all folks care her. What? on the top floor. The Angus Remorse record is in Cynthia's room. In her bathtub. <sighs> okay, 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 okay. More? Oh, one for Odin? Angus Remorse. Angus Remorse is missing. Who took it? Oh, our shame we know, becomes the pale horse. We'll finish it. Oh, Tor, bro. Tor's love for you is in that song. That's why Cynthia wants it, to ruin him. She made Tor lust after her. We fought one scratching hag years ago. Now he's fallen for another, and we might lose him for good. One less Anderson. That isn't going to happen. Cynthia has Tor in the overlap. Anga's remorse is the key to get there. I need to make Cynthia reveal its location. Right. Well, we know where it is. So it's on so Cynthia's room. So let's just go here. Because there's some stuff here. Trash hotel rooms and ruined pools. Crowds go wild for the old gods of Asgard. Ra Ragnarok tour. The rock and roll group old gods of Asgard are leaving chaos in their wake as they plough through major US cities on their aptly named Ragnarok tour. The band is breaking their sales records with singles topping the charts and their latest sold out concert in Long Beach, California. The fans showed their love for the reckless rockers by showering the stage with lacy unmentionables, black roses and even a full bottle uh, four beer bottles. None of this phased the stars themselves who embraced the admiration and transitioned from song to song with such gusto that the audience was left catching their breath eager to keep up with the Brothers Andersons and their cohorts. After out was shenanigans for the musicians included a pool in a private residential neighbourhood left to be emptied and sanitised and a hotel room nearly destroyed in classical fashion not to mention the lengthy room service bill gone unpaid. All things point to this band quickly becoming a strong contender to the iconic Hall of Fame rock groups that came before them. Old Gods of Asgard party like their namesake and give a performance like no other. Be sure to catch them on their tour and bear witness to rock history in the making. Old Gods of Asgard band member dead. The legendary heavy rock band Old Gods of Asgard mourns the loss of their divinely talented guitarist Bob Boulder, Fat Bob, as he was affectionately and ironically called, died from complications of severe illness, leaving his bandmates Odin and Thor Anderson behind. The peace-loving musician will be sorely missed, also by the band's numerous fans. When asked about his loss, Tor Anderson had this to say. Get the expletive out of my face. Boulder is in Valhalla now. He fought cancer like a hero. Bob was too beautiful a soul of this world, added Odin. What this means for the band and their upcoming um, album remains to be seen. That's sad. Rock music is the ancient language of the soul, muses Old Gods of Asgard lead singer. I sit down with the Anderson brothers of Old Gods of Asgard fame in the lobby of a rundown hotel somewhere in downtown Detroit. Currently on their Ragnarok hit tour, the busy band members have only a moment to spare to a fledging journalist and his questions before running off to the soundtrack for their concert tonight. How has the how has the reception been? Amazing. The fans understand what we're about. They get rock and roll. They get the spirit. They know we're not here to censored around. That's censored, right? Why do you why do you do what you do? Raucous laughter. I can tell you're new at this, buddy. Why does anyone do what they do for the glory and the fame, for the money and the sex, or because you have something inside you? That is going to burst out if you don't start using it. It's the latter. That's a good answer. How about music then? What is it about the music that compels you? That should be pretty obvious. 
This is boring me to death, bro. Let's get moving. Sorry, he's always impatient. As they stand up to leave, but the tour bus waiting outside the larger-than-life rockers turn around for one final crow. Music, especially rock and roll, is the ancient language of the soul, man. It's in me, it's godly, and it will come out like a thunderstorm. Okay, well, let's continue the nightmare. And Cynthia's room is on the third floor. Of course it is. And it's... Um, we can actually go into Gail's room as well, and there's uh, RT, there's a conversation to be had. Uh, I think we're going to get the rifle out, bro. Maybe. Saying that right now, I've got a machine gun. Cynthia. Right, 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 no, no, look at where I am. Bro. And I love how it's not showing me where I am. That could be a clue, right? Open this up. What's this? Wheeler set up a foundation with the sales of their greatest hits album. He used the cash to build a nursing facility. The old men deserved it. An old manor in Bright Falls. Wheeler hired a contractor to have it refitted as an old folks' care home. At this point, Wheeler felt good about himself. He had a heart of gold. No need to feel guilty. Wheeler left the work to the contractor and returned to New York City. He had done his part. It was time to turn over a new leaf. The contractors figured out Wheeler was gone for good. They took the money and ran. When the fall rains came, the leaks started appearing. Right, okay. So they used... It's quite sweet that they used like, the... The money to set up all of this. They're moving through slowly. I'm stalling, bro. Templates. No use crying in the dark place. What has been has caught. Trouble doesn't look like this. You can go to the basement and check the generator. What? Oh. But look out. You can never know in which street the devil sits. The basement. Thanks. Cynthia's room. And where were you going, sir? And where were you going? What are you doing sitting up here? Do you know anything about the cult of the tree? Yes, yes. He who reaches for a spruce tree will stumble into a juniper. Bloom was one of them. He has kicked empty. <laughs> I wouldn't want to be in his shoes. But I like his shoes. You say Blum was in the cult? How did you know Blum was part of the cult? Oh, Fox never runs out of tricks. He's a crazy man, and he will show his ways. Bloom like to talk. <laughs> it's crazy, bro. How just terrifying this this game is. It's crazy. Right. Get in, in is forbidden for your own safety. Why? Time is long for those who wait, but in the end. Stand to thanks. Sheesh, <laughs> didn't see you there. Yeah, yeah, do you not know, bro? Close your door, bro. We're not allowed in there. That's interesting, that's interesting. But we're allowed everywhere else around this building. Everything's telling... Right, so basement. How do we get to the basement? Let me look. From the dining room... Basically, no, they no don't. No, you don't. Heard that one before. It's empty. Listen to it outside. Let's get outside then. I just realised. 
Yeah, I just realised all the power's off. Do we need to heal a little bit? We didn't, we didn't have to actually go out there, but... Right, load this up. Jeez, okay. Um, from here... Wellness Center doesn't take us to the basement though, does it? No. Basement. Where is it? Oh, turn back around. Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I think. But I'm turning down my volume because I think there's a jump scare here. I cannot be asked. So you're seeing all these but right. shut out my audio a little bit, sorry guys. I don't know. Oh the emergency muster point <laughs> What? You all should stay out here a while, until it's safe. I'm happy to get out of that house. Isn't it strange that I've lived in Bright Falls my whole life, and I can't remember this building? The house has always been here, Norman. Remember when that poor Nora girl drowned in the bunker? Those Andersons got it so cheap because it's haunted. You get what you pay for. Any other residents missing? Oh, there's so many dialogues here. Any other residents missing? Uh, no, let's just go back here. Any other residents missing? Is there anyone who didn't show up? A few. Artie, Gil, Cynthia. If oh. they aren't here by now, then they aren't coming. It's important to be punctual. Three. On that topic, I'd like to point out that our nightly decaf coffee service is almost half an hour behind schedule. Tell me about Cynthia Weaver. Have any of you noticed anything odd about Ms. Weaver? Just that Tor won't leave the poor woman alone. That brute wants one thing, and one thing only. Cynthia's gotten downright bossy. Take a swim in the pond, Norman. Drink some water, Norman. Well, no one tells Norman MacDonald what to do. Are you injured, Mandy May? Mandy May, are you all right? You're bleeding. Uh, oh, hands. How did that happen? Oh, no, Mandy May. Oh, no. Oh, don't be a crybaby, Norman. It's nothing. I just poked my finger knitting this monster of a blanket. Monster of a blanket. Listen, I've heard your radio show. Hello there. Are you Pat Main from the radio? That's me. And you're the federal agent everyone's been talking about. Would you have time for an interview at some point? Oh, sorry. I'm kind of in a hurry right now. Love your show, though. Very informative. Mm, thank you. Never compromise on quality. That's my motto. We'd be happy to have you on the show any time. Me and my listeners. All right. Well, that was cute. I, I do feel like we're missing something, though. Yeah, I do feel like we're missing something here. 
I feel like I'm struggling to find. The um, the save point, which well not the save point, the uh, basement, but the basement should be. Oh yeah, that's to close the door, right? Let's just go back up here. It's not on this floor, is it at all? I don't think it's on the second floor at all. No, that's his room. Yeah, that's Finley's room. This is Odin's room. This is where we found the record. There was nothing in this room. This room is. Oh, that's so cool that even in this room you're not safe. Right, guys, I've, we're gonna we're gonna leave this here because we're at a good point where I think we're about to head into, well, the next episode will definitely be um, hopefully saving Tor and then on to the next chapter as well, I can imagine. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give the video a like, comment down below, subscribe to the channel, but you know what to do, and I will see you all for the next one.